Well, basically our job is to load the vessel uh, safely and efficiently and make sure that every piece is accounted for. The operation is basically a joint readiness exercise between the second striker, uh, BCT, SCDC, and various other organizations. Uh, they got a no notice, uh, I'll say op order. Uh, they had to move, they, they're supposed to, to try to move all their equipment from the Port of Tacoma to uh, NTC in San Diego, California. We're loading two ships. We load the Cape Isabel uh, with about 500 pieces, and then uh, the, the rest of it is going to go in the Bub Hope, as you see behind me, uh, for a total count of about 1,900 pieces. I would say an average of 40 to 50 pieces per hour. Uh, that's, that's the average that we can load for an exercise like this one. It is definitely a team effort. Uh, as you can see behind me, uh, we have we have uh, members from the 833rd Transportation Battalion. We have the Stevedore and Company who does the labor for us. Uh, we have the, uh, the reservists from the uh, uh, total force integration effort that our, our SCDC commander is trying to push forward. So it takes a lot of people, and that's not counting uh, uh, all the people behind the scenes that are you know, coordinating security, um, operations, um, all, kinds of, all kinds of stuff that you, you're not able to see. It is a great experience. It's a great, it's a great experience. It's, um, I'm honored to be here. Uh, I get to work with our industry partners. Again, like uh, we're working with the uh, Coast Guard, we're working with the Navy, we're working with the commercial uh, port. So it's, it's a great experience. It's a great learning experience and uh, it's something you definitely won't forget. I think it's a, it's a great exercise. I think it needs to be repeated much more often. Um, I think that it actually puts uh, our capabilities to the test and as long as we're capturing those challenges that we have, we can always improve.